Writing the mail, MS sex games from Japan. Collecting without fail those shoot 'em ups, and that's the plan. He doesn't just collect them, he also codes them too. Join us and we'll go on electric adventures with you. Hey YouTube, Electric Adventures here with a little pick up and play a video. Um, there's another couple of titles from what I call my shelf of shame, so um, I can't exactly tell you when I got these titles. Uh, they have said on the shelf I previously did a unboxing part of the video for them, um, but that um, they're, they're all basically ones where I lost that footage before I got a chance to actually do the gameplays due to a hard drive failure. So I'm just basically picking them out in sections. These four games I hold in my hand possibly didn't even come together. Um, but I'm just going to do like you know one system at a time, and what better system to do than some PC Engine games? Now um, I already have a copy of the game Download, um, and it's actually a really good game. And this is Download 2. I've never played it. I don't think I've actually seen any footage. It looks very colourful. It's a CD-ROM game. So oops. So it's even got a little uh, registration card in there. So it's a CD game. I actually played a CD game for a little while too. So we're most interested to see what that one's like. Next we have, and I believe I might have a loose um, hue card of this one. Oh, pardon me. So um, it looks the, the cover looks a little bit like the... Um, uh, was it Demon Seed and Alien Seed, the two pinball games, but it's not. It's it's sort of like a hash, hack and slash platformer from memory. Uh, it's all complete on the inside, so there's a bit of an upgrade. So possibly I have a trade of that, or I could have traded it away already, I don't know. Um, and next we have, this is another Hue card game, we have PC Engine 2. So that's Bonk's adventure in the um, western world number two Very exciting on the back and inside we have our little bit of foam our cover and our hue card um, so I'll be interested to see what that one's like and over the original one and here hidden away is another one of the shooter games in the hue card form but obviously um, I do actually have most of the shooters but there's obviously one I was missing um, this is Barum Barumba, Barumba, maybe I'm saying that wrong. So it's another Namcot shooter. The Namcot brought out lots of titles for the PC Engine. Um, and it's all complete in sight. Obviously they're not in perfect condition. Um, but they are still better than having no copy at all. So I think I'll get the case of it than a bit of uh, discoloration. Alright, um, so without further ado, that's the end of the unboxing bit. Let's go give them a play. Right, so here we go with Baran Baran Ba. There's an N, not a B. The ship is in the way, so give me, give me grief. Um, so another Namco game, or Namcot, as they were known then. So you can choose different stages, I suppose, later on. So here's our ship. We can shoot. We can use the other button to turn it. Out. Direction of a shot. Thank you. 
I've got a, a dead spot in the middle. I'll definitely have to have more than one game, I think. That doesn't look too bad. I mean, I suppose the pallet's a little subdued. I'm only using a two button pad here. I was thinking that maybe if I used it with a pad with more buttons, we'd be able to rotate in more directions. I really don't know what the best symbols do. Seems to be increasing the power of my shots, I think. Oh, now it has. So you need to keep on hitting the same ones of these. Let's concentrate on those. I'm not using any sort of turbo. Stop the button. Life. Right, so that increases their health. Now, any increase in my shots seems to have See, it definitely has novelty and um, probably more gameplay that I'm giving doing it justice. Uh, definitely one I'll have to keep out and um, have a bit more of a game of. All right, well we do have four to look at, so let's have a look at the next game. All right, so here we go with PC Genjin 2 or Box Adventure 2. Now I'm bound to be terrible at this because I've never played this one before. I would select. Don't know. Let's go for that one. So looks like introducing another character or something. So here's our bonk. Hit from the head and jump. Right, those bits of fruit. Hit those things as long as they're in flight. Swim up the river so I can send you connect. Yeah, it's okay, so and then we got these things. Jump on them and get through. Those things we need to. some stuff down there. Now, bond games are usually not too hard to get into. Oops. It's like you could jump on those to them. two guards to be able to go up. As you can see, it's quite a colourful game. Hmm, that's interesting. Right. Whoa! Okay, we sort of did it first level. Some of those other ones as well. 
It's an excellent one, and it's definitely a step up from uh, the first game. I do have two other lives, by the way, but um, the gameplay takes too long. The graphics are a little better. It's got um, definitely a different theme. I'll definitely be uh, leaving that one around the PC Engine to give a bit more of a gameplay out of and seeing how far I can get. They're quite big games, too. I've um, also got the uh, Super Famicom version, which I got a little while back from i got it from Nintendo Arcade. So I do really enjoy the series and it's sad that this one's been sitting on my shelf and not played for quite some time, so I'll definitely be playing some more. Alright, I'll stop rambling and let's go on with our next game. Right, so one of the interesting cover is actually called Necromancer. Go through a dire sequence at the moment. Right, um, obviously you can continue as well, so it's from Hudson Soft. We've got both Kanji and right, and we keep going. Yeah. Okay. So I'm a dude wandering around. Ah, so we've got a bit of an RPG.
actually have a, um, an Everdrive for which I've had quite for some time um, for my PC engine. This one would one be one that definitely be worth downloading a English translation of, which there are out there. So not a bad title, just nice to complete it rather than a loose one that I didn't obviously didn't know much about either. So an RPG undiscovered. So cool. All right, let's try our next game. <laughs> Okay, we're getting a bit of an intro here at the moment. Guy stroking a brain in a box. Download. So it was. Human's Giga Pattern of Computer Memory. Of course, this is a CD-ROM. Get CD-ROMs now, which is excellent. High technology no question there. Cool. Our first download was quite a decent game.
lives, but... I said... Okay. Ooh, some sort of end little thing. <笑>なんだお前は。さて、ポリスがやっとったものいぬだな。オッケー、ウェスタカムジュニ。様が犯人。本人人聞きの悪いこと言わないでほしいな。これは耳人族闘争なのだよ。一体何のデータを発掘した